Hey guys, today I'm going to review Smell Swell Lightning McQueen from the Storyteller's Collection. Now, the Storyteller book where he appeared is called, and now a word for our sponsor. So, let's get started. So, in the Storyteller's line that was released in 2007 or 2008, yeah, that line is very good, and the new cars that were released in the and that line were Smell Swell McQueen and Sponsorless McQueen from that book series. Along and there's a lot of other new cars, and the others were a new a different kind of paint drop of Ramon, the three showgirls. And Baba, the bully, and Mater's cousins, Judd Buford and Cletus. I really always wanted Judd Buford and Cletus super bad. I wish they released um I wish they released Lu cousin Lewis and Saint and Tommy Joan, but they didn't do that because they were not in the book. That would be cool if Mattel released video game character cars. When it'll be great, but yeah, anyways, let's get on the review of him. Now, Lightning McQueen used to be a Smell Swell racer before he was converted to the Rusty Self like here. Which you of course know that if you're a Cars fan and an OG Cars fan like me, you can already know that Lightning McQueen was a Rusty racer in the movie. But for Smell Swell McQueen, he well, he had not a lot of decals. The only decals that he had were the green 95 with the lightning bolt on the side, and the Smell Swell logo with the Smell Swell deodorizer logo. I'm not sure what that sponsor is supposed to be. And when he was racing, he wasn't doing that good, and his sponsor fired him, and then. He did not have the Smell Swell logo anymore. Also, not only that, um, he, Mac helped him to be the Rusty's Racer. The original Rusty's Racer. I don't know who the heck is that car. He kind of looks like Mario and Grady, but he retired and we don't know what his number would look like in the trailer of Mac with that car. And Mac, he didn't have the Lightning Bolt or Night 5 on the original one in the book, but he only had that. And, but he didn't have that until he had the uh, when Lightning is the Rusty's Racer that replaced the Rusty's Racer. And yes, Ru Rusty and Dusty are looking for a new Rusty's Racer. And Fred is in this video because he was in that book too. And yeah. So, as you can notice a comparison, Sponsorless McQueen has a different expression. He has a mall play for some reason. I do not understand why. And he has flat eyelids for some reason, but this most well regular one. He does have race stylists. I don't know what's going on, but yeah. And by the way, um, Smell Swell McQueen does not have light ear tires for the sponsorless one for some reason. I don't know how was that possible, but yeah. And he has no decals on the tail lights or on the spoiler. The gas cap is for some reason not painted. He's Almost completely red. And, yeah. Very good release. He did get a re-release in 2017 in the um, blind boxes with the other McQueens. I believe there was the other five were... And there was a Puzzle McQueen boxes. And there was also Tongue McQueen, Cactus McQueen, Tumbleweed McQueen, Bling Bling McQueen. And I'm not... Who was the other McQueen? I cannot remember because Jesus, those things are so old. Oh wait, never mind. I now I now know it's Dirt Track McQueen. But yeah, 
So here's a comparison with the regular Rusty McQueen. And they definitely changed. Now, the regular Rusty McQueen had the rookie stripe because he was a rookie in the in Cars 1. Whereas the Smell Swell one doesn't have it. And also there are some other cars from that from the race that he used to be in. There's like some other cars. I have no idea who they are, but that, it'll be cool if they made diecast of them. But yeah. And they really should have made more meter um storyteller cars, like Brand new meter without the hood, you know the one without it when Bubba took it. Yeah, that would be cool if they released that, or they could be released that in the heavy metal meter cars tune line, but they didn't. Along with um, Miss Victoria from the Showgirls book, and that hauler that um, carries the Showgirl cars. And there's just so many cool cars from those books. Also, fun fact about the Storyteller cars, they actually do cars from the Christmas book. And they really should have released some other Christmas cars. That would be really amazing. But yeah. So anyways, that is all for this video. Make sure to subscribe to my channel because cars is awesome. So anyways, guys. Bye now. Ciao.